Welcome back, everyone. The Hamas Mountains could see new life, all thanks to a project to reforest that area that was badly damaged by the Las Conchas fire. More than 150,000 acres burned in the 2011 wildfire. News 13's Jamie Seymour shows us how one team plans to regrow the forest. One of the worst fires in New Mexico history, the 2011 Las Conchas fire wiped out thousands of acres of wildlife in the Jemez Mountains, and it hasn't been quick to regrow. That fire footprint is, is pretty devastating, so we're not seeing a lot of natural regeneration occur. Now the team at New Mexico State University's Forestry Research Center is stepping in to get things growing again. Tucked into the heart of Mora, this is the largest forest nursery in the southwest, and the work being done inside is years in the making. They've spent the past few years collecting ponderosa pine seeds that will eventually be placed in the burn scars where they aren't growing back on their own. It took a full four years before we could get a cone crop we could collect from that would be sufficient to grow up the seedlings to reforest that area. With more than 250,000 seeds collected, they've spent the past year nurturing them in greenhouses. When we're ready to grow those seedlings for the reforestation operation, we plant those seeds, we sow those seeds, usually in containers. The seedlings are monitored daily, and once the hot and dry summer period is over, they plan to ramp up planting in the Jemez. These seedlings that we grow here are just little bits of hope, and I think that we all need a little bit of that right now. Planting of the seedlings is set to begin in the next couple months. Reporting in Mora, Jamie Seymour, CARE News 13. So the team is also starting to collect seeds and grow seedlings to plant in the area hit hard by the 2018's Ute Park fire.